inspiration for this fragrant poached chicken dish was really the idea of the classic Chinese master stock chicken. And then adding components that I felt were compatible and on the texture and the flavour profile point of view. And it's really about the layering of flavours and textures in this dish. We'll take the eggplants and we'll cook them very slowly in the oven and then we'll put them in a cold smoker to introduce some smoke. And then we make a puree out of that and add a little bit of oil. And that's sort of on the base of the dish to give the dish some richness. Then we have the poached chicken. It's poached almost like a classic master stock chicken. It's cooked very gently and left very succulent. We make a silken noodle. We make the noodle from wheat flour with a little bit of kuzu starch. And this adds a really silky, almost slightly chewy sort of noodle to the dish. We have some beautiful freshly shucked sea scallops from Tasmania, which are thinly sliced and marinated. Then we have the Japanese white radish, which we julienne very thinly, and we actually salt the radish down until it becomes a little bit soft. And then we dress it in a little bit of sesame oil, and we actually twist it like a braid to give the salad some texture. We have some Chinese artichokes. Chinese artichokes are very unusual. In Europe, they call them prones. They're a type of tuber. They almost look like a little grub, uh, a widgety grub. But they're a sort of spiral in shape and have a very crunchy texture, just like a water chestnut. Then we add a little egg white pearl. So we take a little bit of scallop uh, meat, add a little bit of creme fraiche, and coat it in these tiny little egg white pearl droplets. And we frame it in a little petal of the Japanese white radish. There's also a beautiful ginger milk curd. So we set a fresh milk curd on top of the salad. The dish is garnished with snow pea flour petals which add a real elegance to the dish. 